Bend's restaurants participating in downtown South Bend Restaurant Week are seeing more customers thanks to the warmer weather. WSBT 22's Heather Black talked to a few restaurant owners. And Heather, how do they feel about this year's turnout? Well, Rick, they're excited to see so many people coming to downtown areas supporting local restaurants. I asked some owners how this year's Restaurant Week is different from years before. Snow was piled high just two years ago during Restaurant Week in downtown South Bend. This year, there is very little snow with warmer weather. Lots to choose from here. LaSalle Grill founder Mark McDonald says they've seen an increase in sales from the last two years. This year, we're about 20% over last year and 30% over. 2014. It's been a phenomenal year. McDonnell remembers being forced to close his restaurant in 2014 because of a snowstorm. He says this year's turnout is more than just better weather. The combination of things. We have wonderful weather and gas prices are lower than they've been in years and years and years. And I think that gives people a sense that they've got extra money in their pocket. While LaSalle Grill is seeing an increase in customers this year, others are enjoying Restaurant Week for the first time. Uh, it's going fantastic. We have been overwhelmed with visitors all last week, all through the weekend. Tapestry is a new downtown restaurant that has only been open for 11 weeks. Manager Peggy Swihart says Restaurant Week is important to introducing the community to their unique taste. People are coming down to check out the restaurants, and it's a huge draw uh, just to expose what's down here. And 18 downtown restaurants are part of Restaurant Week, and 10% of all the proceeds made from the two weeks go to Memorial Children's Hospital. And if you want to see the full list of the restaurants, you can go to our website, WSBT.com. Rick.